legislative matters, the House of Representatives has urged all parties involved in the ongoing dispute in the petroleum sector to cease allegations and counter-allegations pending the outcome of his investigation on the myriad of challenges in the sector. Their House Joint Committee, comprising the Midstream and Downstream Petroleum Committees, commenced a forensic legislative investigation into allegations of substandard petroleum products, non-availability of crude oil to domestic refineries, and other related matters. Correspondent Nabuchi Nabuchi sent in the report. The investigation, according to the chairman of the committee, will proceed in phases, starting with allegations against Dangote Refinery and the Nigerian Midstream and Downstream Petroleum Regulatory Authority regarding the quality of produce and imported product, as well as a complaint by refining companies about the non-availability of crude oil supply to domestic refineries. The said committee will also investigate all the key items, such as the presence of middlemen in crude trading and discriminate issuance of licenses and a lack of international standard laboratories to check adulterated products, among others. The investigative hearing, which began in on Monday, aims to restore trust and ensure the quality and security of Nigeria's petroleum sector, in line with the federal government's renewed hope agenda. We are committed to transparency, thoroughness, and accountability throughout this process. That will help us throughout this process. That will help us to identify and resolve the underlying issue plaguing Nigeria's petroleum sector. The committee is also urging stakeholders in the current disputes to de-escalate tension as the committee embarks on the great task of resolving the issue. Our mandate as set by the House on, the, on July 9th encompasses a comprehensive forensic legislative investigation into the several critical areas, including but not restricted. One, the importation and production of substandard petroleum products the availability of good and quality crude oil supply to domestic refineries. Three, the enforcement of regulatory standards by bodies such as the Nigerian Mainstream Downstream Petroleum Regulatory Authority, the NMDPRA. Deputy Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Benjamin Kalu, who represented the Speaker, Honorable Tajuddin Abbas, stated that President Bola Ahmed Chinubu is committed to creating a fair and level playing field for producers and refiners in the industry. He urged the Joint Petroleum Committee on Mainstream and Downstream Sectors to ensure that the pricing model used by all producers does not harm domestic refineries. Kali also encouraged the communities to work towards aligning the domestic crude oil supply obligation with the nation's energy security in collaboration with sector regulators to address the challenges and re-engineer the regulatory processes. The hearing was adjourned to allow all parties to make presentations on the activities in the petroleum sector. It must be reiterated that President Bola Ahmed Tinubu is fully committed. Therefore, I implore the rule of engagement to ensure that the pricing model from the oil producers does not hinder the, the, the domestic refineries. I also applaud the Joint Petroleum Committee on Mystery and Downstream Sectors to work together towards a convergence between the domestic crude oil supply obligation and the nation's energy security as it works with the sector regulators to re-engineer their respective regulatory processes.